Yo, what's up everybody? It's me, Doug and McNugget. <laughs> I always laugh at saying that because it sounds so silly. <laughs> How's it going? I am back with another <laughs> another episode of Resident Evil Code Veronica. I told I told myself yesterday it was gonna be the last day, but <laughs> after after yesterday's performance, yeah, we we are back. We can't we can't finish it like that. We, I couldn't finish it. I couldn't finish it yesterday. It was it was really tough. Look at the electricity's already on. Um, last time we left off, we beat what's her name, um, Alexia. Um, Alexia, she was all gray form. Alexia, we got Amy in the chat. What's up? Thank you for coming out. Um, and we beat Steve. Dude, Steve died, and he died. All right, he died pretty cool. I have to admit. But, uh, yeah, we still hate him. That one death doesn't count for everything he's done. Doesn't make up for everything he's done. Um, now let's get started. We are at the home stretch of this damn game. Okay. So, let's, let's do this, let's do this. What do we need right now? Blue herbs and all that. Okay, from what I remember, we're gonna get a lot of items. So we're gonna we're gonna make room. We're gonna make some room right now. Uh, that that looks that looks pretty good for now. Okay, let's. Let's go. Let's do it. So far, so good. Uh, sure, we'll take the blue herb. We don't really need it. Hell yeah. Dude, I love how the PlayStation 3 could barely, could still, like, not put this at, what, a solid 30 frames? Is that what the game was at? Like, it's, it's, the frame is dipping here? Come on. Come on, PS3. You, you got this. You could have upscaled it or whatever. Whatever you want to call it. Okay, so we're, here we are. It's cracked, it's cracked. Yeah, we know, we know. This is all stuff that we've done yesterday, but unfortunately I did die. <coughs> I'm gonna combine those two together. We don't wanna get hurt. We don't wanna get hurt. Dude, my nails is starting to feel weird against my controller. Like, every time I press a button, it just feels like there's a lot of pressure behind him. <laughs> Is this how nails feel? Is this how nails are supposed to feel? I don't, I don't get it. Oh really? You're supposed to fall down. I can't figure out why your nails would be touching your controller. It's not that they're touching the controller. It's that like I press down and when you press down, <laughs> you know, like, the skin goes up. I, I don't know, like, think about it. And then now that there's, like, nail behind my skin, it's, it's feeling the pressure against the nail. They used to be nubs, remember? There wasn't anything behind it. <laughs> Come on. I need somebody who can relate to me. Okay, let's see here. 
gonna put away the blue herb. Cause I feel, I feel like it's gonna get in the way. Blue herb, go away, blue herb. We don't need blue herb. We don't even need knife anymore. I feel. Let's put knife away. Yeah, I get it. And thug a McNugget. Wait, what? Move lever. Oh no no no! I don't want to move that. At least I don't think I want to move that. Yeah, we don't believe in wasting bullets, but we're gonna waste some bullets now. I think we're we made it to the end of the game. We could we could relax on the bullets a little bit. We've hoarded like so much uh, ink cartridges that I think we could. Uh, could lighten up on a lot of things. Left. I think I'm gonna need these jewels. Why else would they be able to go into my inventory? I have an idea. And then I have to turn off the lights in order to get the b both of them. Okay, let's do that. to keep backtracking and backtracking but we're okay you know what just so that I don't have to keep backtracking we're gonna put away our gun and our ammo we don't need this I uh, don't need to combine them just yet so there Hopefully everybody had a great Tuesday. Today Tuesday was pretty good. Not gonna lie. Tuesday was really well. Last night, I actually slept a full night. Like, well, actually no, I did wake up once. But, but compared to the past nights, these past few months, I have not been sleeping well. And yesterday was was good actually. I even slept early. So that's cool. Everything's cool. Shit, I, I forgot to get the, the eyes. Wait, wait, well, I'll just go backwards. Ooh. Oh, 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 oh. I remember this. Big girth. The big girth. Okay. Yo, Crystal, what's up? Thank you for showing up. You're here for the finale? You want to see a finale? You want to see what's going to happen? We're gonna, we're gonna finish this. Open the door! <laughs> yes. All right. We're gonna, we're gonna get the, we're gonna get there. We're gonna get there. I might need some help though. Virus research report. Work continues on the T virus, the T Veronica virus, <laughs> uh, which I extracted from the queen ant. The more research I conduct on it, the more I am impressed by how much potential it has. I have finally implanted the virus into my own body and discovered how to utilize its power. I will avoid making the mistake that I made on my father. I will suppress the activity of the virus at an ultra low temperature so that my cells will change slowly. 
My circulations indicate that it will take 15 years before my body will gain immunity and become able to coexist with the virus. Until then, I have no choice but to trust the capsule that I will be in to that inept but loyal soldier ant who is my brother for me to obtain unlimited power. Some risks will be taken. When I awaken, I will be the queen and the T. Veronica virus will be unleashed upon the entire world by my children. Every last creature of this earth will serve, will exist to serve me. At the at that time, the world will achieve the perfect ecosystem, just like the ant hill, but on a much grander scale. Alexia Ashford. Okay. No, that's creepy. Okay, what's up here? Nothing. Wait, what? As twins, Alexia and I were sent to coffee, and I designed card under the name Alexia. Heart. Okay. Heart spade AA crown. There's a button with the design. Push the button. Heart. Spade. AA. Crown. There's no response. What? Okay. You know what? I think I need that little paperweight. Go ahead and get that. Oh, oh. Oh, oh, I really hope these, these things don't do that much damage. Yeah, okay, they're not, they're not doing that much damage. Crystal, how was your day? How's Momo? How's the cats? How is the cats? <laughs> the cats education. <laughs> I'm sorry that you did. I did come out to your stream. I'm sorry that you had to cut it short, but yo, I totally understand. Momo definitely needs attention, baby kitty. <laughs> you even said it yourself. You were playing with one hand. I think that was impressive enough. Okay, so let's uh, do this. Let's just put this here. The cat is growing up to become a beautiful car. <laughs> that was so funny. I know it was a typo, but I mean, you gotta, I gotta call that out. <laughs> the cat is growing up to be a beautiful car. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, so let's go back. Uh, let's go. Get what? It's locked. This should be. It should open it. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I should leave it off then. Hmm. Hmm. No, I'm not too sure. Aren't I supposed to have a key or something? Uh, da 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 da. Oh, I'm stupid. She's very good. I ended up taking a nap with her after she had her plate. Oh, that sounds nice. A cat nap. <laughs> See what I did there? Dude, a nap sounds great. After. After work, I wish I could take naps, but streaming took over. Okay. Um, I don't even remember what to do. Um, okay, so we need, we need this. 
Nope, nope, not that, because I unfortunately don't have the magnum. Let's do this. I unfortunately do not have the magnum. Let's uh turn on this thing just in case. Or maybe I should uh what do you mm. let's leave it on for now. I'm super undecided and decided like should I should I go here? Should I go there? Should I leave this? Should I take it? I hate it. Okay. Dude, look at that posture. Superior posture. Okay. Um, this way, right? Yes, it's here. I'm going to switch to this gun. Because I know one of these green crocodile dudes are going to come out. All this I've actually done in the last stream, but I ended up dying. And I was just like, you know what? I can't keep going. I needed to stop. There was so much salt in the last stream, I will admit. Oh, no. Oh, wow. That's it? I thought it was at least going to take two. Cool. Dude, this is like best case scenario right now. Hunter became the hunted. Do they still have their power move here? I'm not sure. What is their power move? Uh, let's go here. The hunters, or do you mean uh, that one shot claw? Oh, that. You know what? I don't know. I don't think so. That messed me up so much in the other Resident Evils. Wait, uh, I'll let you know. I like these. Compared to the Resident Evil 2 stalkers or whatever they're called, lurkers or whatever, I prefer these green men. Those were nuts. Ow. Ow. <clears throat> okay, so this machine is asking me to put in a code something's written on it as twins alexia and i are two sides of a coin a design is carved under heart two sides of coin okay okay i think i get it so check two sides of a coin so first one was the heart the heart is a a spade Crown, A A, heart, and then the last one was okay. 
Our last one was a crown, and then it was a spade. So it would be, uh, uh, uh. So it's A A crown, heart spade. I should put something in here. I'm guessing it's this. Uh, I'm surprised they didn't bring back the poison lurkers for Resident Evil 2. I don't remember that. Oh! Alexander, dude. I think that was her name. Dude, I love how it, she just stuffed his dead body there. I wonder what she was trying to do. Probably revive him or something. I don't remember them in the original. I did play the original, but I didn't like play it so much. I think I just did like one playthrough of the original too. Oh dude. Okay, alright. Yo, we're fine. We're good. <sighs> okay. What is over here? Oh. Oh, shoot, I'm so sorry. I didn't want to... I'm saying sorry to the to the Zambo. I'm so sorry, Zambo. I don't want to take the blue herb. Not enough red herbs in this game. Some alcohol still left inside. Okay. What's this? Research report on Queen, uh, Queen Ant. After discovering the remains of an ancient virus within the genes of Queen Ant, I have been concentrating on the research of ants. The ecosystem of the ants seems truly ideal to me. There is one Queen Ant in each ant hill, and the soldier and work ants are the Queen's slaves. They dedicate their lives to the Queen. The death of the Queen Ant means the doom of their entire ant hill. However, the soldier and worker ants can still easily replace be easily replaced as long as the queen ant is alive. This is exactly the same relationship between myself and the other ignorant masses. I have succeeded in creating an ideal virus by implanting the queen ant gene into the mother virus that Spencer found. I used my otherwise useless father as a test subject, however, as I expected, the virus caused a rapid change in the cells, triggering the complete destruction of his brain cells and body flesh. Furthermore, a special type of poison gas was generated inside his body that the blue herb had no effect against. Because of this, I created an antidote in case of an emergency and stored it inside the weapon chemical warehouse on B2 floor. I have decided to name this virus with unimaginable potential the T. Veronica virus. When I find out how I can utilize the power of this wonderful virus. My great research will finally be complete. Okay. Alright, cool, cool. I understand, I understand. Is there anything over here? Dude, it's so dark. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, even you? Oh, what the? No. All right. Oh, this is annoying. I should have just probably used one, uh, one grenade launcher. All right. Uh, it's so freaking dark in here. What? Oh, okay. Cool. What is in here? 
computer terminal it must have been hooked to a supercomputer. Queen Ant is what? The Queen Ant is dead. The Ant Hill seems to have perished. Oh look, more gun bullets here. Hmm. Is there anything else in here? I feel like I'm missing something. It's a beautiful portrait of a woman, the master of Astrid family, Veronica. <sighs> Am I missing anything? What's up, Crystal? Hmm. Okay, I feel like I need to turn off the lights here, but I cannot. Because... The panels? Hmm? Okay, I'll, I will check them out after. <laughs> Did you really make me some more panels? I don't think I asked for more. Check, <laughs> I'll check them out in a bit. Well, after the stream, of course. Honestly, I was thinking about... It's, it's the same ones, but there were... Oh, okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. So now I have... Okay. <laughs> I was like, what? Did I ask for more? Oh, look at that. Another green herb. Dude. <laughs> Now the game's giving me so much, so many green herbs. What happened before? Uh, what is over here? Oh. Oh. Nah, <laughs> it's all good. Okay, so there's two there. Another green herb? What the heck? Combine. Let's combine these. Game, what are you doing? What are you planning? <sighs> okay, so I'm guessing they want me to make the dragonfly. I have gotten three of the probably four wings right um i don't think i have the body though this is like the second time they they make me get a dragonfly Wait, ah, no, 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 no. I'm gonna save. 
I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save. I know I can save over here, so I'm gonna save it over here. I've done I've done so much for the for the spider to just probably one shot me or something. I am not gonna do all that. Thirty four minutes of the stream. Okay. I honestly don't think I'll need the handgun. We should be able to kill it quickly. But you never know, I guess. You played all the Resident Evil games? No, I haven't. I haven't. Um so this is this is the list of Resident Evil games that I, I intend to play. Um, so I've already done one through three. We're gonna finish uh, Code Veronica. Next Resident Evil on the list is uh, Resident Evil Zero. <laughs> What's up, Pretty AV? Yes, we got Chris here. So it's Resident Evil Zero. Then it's going to be Resident Evil 4, 5, and 6. 5 and 6 I'm going to play with somebody else, co-op. Um, then I'm also going to be doing Resident Evil Re uh, Revelations as well. And then getting to um, Biohazard and Village. But I have not played 5, 6... Seven, eight, and zero, and revelations one and two. I've not played those. Done. Okay, something fell. I'm guessing that was the other wing. Yeah. Oh, my bad. Oh, no. They're all gathering over here. 
Come over here, spiders. Dude, look at them. They're all trying to kill me. All right, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> Yo, I I would die if if they were um what are they called? Cockroaches. I hate roaches. Oh, oh. I hate them. I hate them. I could handle like little ones, but if they were like the big big ones, no. Nope, nope, nope. What is this? Where is this taking me? I have no idea where I'm going anymore. I know I should plug in those stones now. Okay. I remember they said I needed a fire extinguisher. Which I do not have. Getting some water. Okay, there you go. Yeah, uh, the German, the German uh, roaches. Yeah, those are the tiny ones that multiply increasingly, like, like super fast. Little ones are totally worse. Yo, Nerona, how's it going? Thank you for coming back. I hate the big ones because they fly and they're like, they fly across your room. They're not, they're not scared of anything. Just got, just off work. I'm good now. Nice. In the past couple of evenings, I felt like I've been getting sick, but I don't get sick. And as I tell my friends, I'm so ready to get sick. Like, I just want to get sick so I have to, I could call off of work guilt free. You know, <laughs> guilt free. <laughs> like, I could just call off and just be like, okay, I only have one mission and that is to rest, you know? I never seen a big one till I moved to Alabama when I asked my buddy there. What the fuck kind of bug it was? He laughed far too much. Yeah, we uh, we in Texas we get those those big Texas ones. <laughs> They're not fun. I hate them. Uh, we can put this away. So uh, you know what? Let's let's put. Uh, I don't want to. Uh, this is like my security blanket. Okay, all right. You know what, and we just, uh, well, no to Texas. <clears throat> yeah, it's only like, I don't know. I don't, I don't know what, what causes those, those big roaches to, to appear. Cause they, they go, oh no, stop, <laughs> Andy, stop, I hate you. <laughs> like, whenever you see one crawling at the corner of your room and you're on the opposite corner, you feel, you feel you're safe until it just like lets go of the wall and you just see it fly down. And they like just go everywhere, dude. Oh, I hate that so much. I hate it. I hate it. Not for me, brother. Or like you, you see one on the roof, 
and as soon as you see it on the roof, it lets go. <laughs> with a <the> clown mask. <laughs> you have some weird some weird happenings over there. Nerona. Come on. <laughs> Imagine that with the clown mask. I'm pretty maybe maybe it wouldn't be as bad with a clown mask, honestly. I just hate roaches. I hate those big roaches. Uh, okay. And we're gonna combine these two together. We're gonna use. Oh, hell yeah. I hate the camera angle because I can't see how far they are. Alright, looks like we're in another lab. What is that? Code Veronica report. After many long years of research, I finally identified the inheritance element that administers the intelligence of man. I don't know what I just said. I even succeeded in manipulating the absolute value of intelligence artificially by recomposing the base alignment of the element. I then sampled the gene of our great ancestor, manipulated its element, and then implanted it into an unfertilized egg of a surrogate mother. What I didn't expect was that twins, a boy and a girl, were born. The boy had a higher intelligence than normal, but not high enough for him to be considered a genius. However, the girl had an unmatched intelligence that easily allowed her to be classified as a genius. She was exactly what I had been looking for, the revival of our great ancestor. I already determined their names. The girl's name is Alexia and the boy's name is Alfred. I'm certain that Alexia will elevate the name of the Ashford family to extreme glory. Aw, dude. Hmm. Okay. Look at that. There's some herbs there. We should, we should get the herbs. Every time I say herbs, I think I'm saying uh, The Sims or The Herbs, those, that Sim game. Who remembers that game? I never played it, but I was always kind of curious about it. the gun yeah herbs sims in the city that's yeah that one was that that's the whole title right Whoa. did you play it crystal did you like it was it good I'm guessing it was like a story mode kind of game, but like with Sims mechanics, right? I'm gonna lock the door. That was your first Sims game? Okay, that's cool. How'd you like it? Oh? Oh, 
Oh, dude. Come on. Oh. Are you serious? I'm just wasting my. There you go. And then I became a sinner after that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I know you didn't say sinner. Uh, yeah, Sims is great. I love The Sims. Um, I've never played a Sims game. Nerona, you're missing out. I don't know. Like they're so, they're so fun. I don't know. I don't know how to explain it. It's so wacky and and just out there. I love I love playing it on a on a like a. On a relaxing day or something. Pretty AV plays The Sims 4 sometimes on his stream. And he usually plays it on a Sunday. So I really enjoy watching him play it uh, on Sundays. Whenever he does. It's not very often, but it's just something. There's something relaxing about it. Okay, what am I doing now? What am I doing now? What am I doing? Shotgun shells. You should you should definitely play one Arona. Um personally I love the original. There's something there's something spooky or not spooky but just like eerie about the original one. Two is awesome. I don't think you I don't know where you could find one and two anymore. But three is supposedly like the best one in the series. Uh that's on Steam. Four allows you to create a lot, but they've taken out a lot as well. So a lot of people are like hit and miss with part four. Let me put some of these away. getting a little stuffy in my room. I don't have my air conditioning on right now. Or like my fan or anything, so. I should turn those on soon. We're getting really close to the ending. Oh? Claire? Is that you, Claire? Chris? No! The door won't open! Hey, is Steve with you? <laughs> Steve. Steve. <laughs> oh, Steve. <laughs> Listen, Claire. You have to get out of here immediately. Can you unlock it from the inside? No, I can't. self-destruct system somewhere if you activate it all the electronic locks might be deactivated <laughs> what do you mean continue the <laughs> I don't know what you mean by that Don't, if it's if it's something with part five, six, seven, eight, do not tell me. I, no spoilers, please. <laughs> but I was just thinking that too. Like, I was thinking, did Claire? Okay, we know that Steve loved 
clear, right? I guess it was just like, you know, they were all in this, they were in this together kind of thing. So I'm sure, like, he felt the type of way, a sort of way to her. But it's like, okay, who, who should Claire, like, end up with? In my head, Leon always, uh, Leon needs to finish with Ada Wong. I always thought that Le Leon and Claire were going to be a thing that Leon sent for Ada. Yes, that, that's, o that's always been, like, my theory that, like, Leon ends up with Claire, not Claire, sorry, with Ada. Come on. Come on. And then, like, the remake of Part 2, that just, like, confirms it. Is this... There's me some kind of control panel. Like, they really put a lot of, like, emphasis on... on Leon and Claire. And I, I keep saying Claire. Leon and Ada. And then I feel like Chris was supposed to like end up with Jill or something. I think. I'm not sure. I mean, they don't need to end up with anybody. But like, this is all, this is all like fan theory. I, I'm guessing. Conjecture? Fan? Conjec conjecture? Okay, I haven't gotten down here. Okay. Oh. No, 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 wrong gun, wrong gun. Oh, I need a... So which one is writing up the fanfic? Have you ever played a Resident Evil, Narona? Maybe you should uh, write it. I trust your I trust your work. Where is There's another one walking, isn't there? Yo, why is the game giving me so many herbs? Yeah, I think you have a great imagination. You should play some. You should play some Resident Evil sometime. They're really great. They're fun. Have you guys seen that there's a remake of... They, like, a fan remake of the first one and Code Veronica. It kind of makes me want to play Code Veronica again. There's a fan remake of it, and it looks so good. Honestly. I feel bad for Steve and other forgotten characters. I have, I have Resident Evil 6, but I've never played it. I hear good things and bad things about Resident Evil 6. I think that was like... I think that's like the only bad res received one. Like, just universally, like... People were not for it. And I want to know why. I've never played it. I think it was that it was like just not enough horror. But then, like, how is it, like, action? Like, how is the action, you know? Maybe the action's good. It's, but it, it's, I guess it's a departure of the survival horror and more, like, action, like, horror action. It's a portrait of a beautiful woman, the master of Esher family, Veronica. Cool. Uh, is that it? I will save here. Ah, uh, thank you, Jules. I got to play with a friend, but his girlfriend went ape. When she found out? Dude, why? Like, we're just playing a game together. Unless maybe she wanted to play it? I don't know. Some people are crazy. Yep, some people are crazy. Whoa, trust issues. <laughs> yeah, definitely. It's like, oh my god, you guys are playing games together? You guys are fucking falling in love. Like, or something. Like, you guys have something for each other. Like, 
Really, dude? Alright, now there's a... There we go. Zambo! Come on, turn around. Alright. We got the Zambo. Um... Wait, what's in here? Locked from the other side? We played well together, all three of us. She just did not want him to be a uh, want. Okay, did not want you to be alone with. Okay, that's weird. It must have gotten real awkward when like he was online and you were online, and you'd send him a message, but he wouldn't reply or anything, or he'd be like, "Oh yeah, uh, we could play when my girlfriend's on." Sorry. <laughs> I'm being I'm also being dumb. <laughs> okay, so dude, this use? There's no need to use it now. Check. Something's easily caught inside. Um, let's see, Lowell. Honestly, I had a controlling relationship like that before. No good. Oh, that sucks. I'm sorry about that. I don't know. <sighs> I couldn't stand it. <laughs> I don't know. I guess I guess uh, like people should just put their foot down and just be like, "Yo, like <laughs> stop trying to control me." I don't know. It sucks. It really does suck. What was in this room? I have the I have the attention span of a ant. That is that room. Never mind. Right now, what we need to do is get the. Um, damn it! What are, what is it called? We need to get the eyes of the lion and the and the to get the eyes of the lion. I don't remember. Oh, wait, we have a key. Is this song just gonna keep playing on a loop? Yeah, we don't need this anymore. codependent they don't know how to be yeah I guess that's what it comes down to sometimes when you're in a relationship like you get confused with being with somebody for the right reasons and just being what's it called comfortable having that person around and the the uh, the lines become blurred and you think that like like what you have what you're feeling is love but I mean it's just comfort you know like changes change can suck okay what's up mr. Cheems how's it going dude okay okay I need to turn on a fan it's getting pretty hot in here let me turn this or let me save for sure. 
we're nearing the end of Resident Evil Code Veronica. We have the the music playing. Okay. Okay, let's see. Sorry, I'm like standing right now. I'm not at my camera. Hold on, give me one second, I'll be right back. Yo, what's up? Sorry about that. <laughs> I was like, I'm standing up, might as well go to the potty. <laughs> Let's be real, I couldn't be in a relationship like that unless he was willing to go to Hobby Lobby with me. Yo, <laughs> Hobby Lobby! <laughs> There's so many goodies. <laughs> Hobby Lobby is cool. I am not skilled enough to create anything. <laughs> but I love going to like their like... <laughs> I love going to like their little toy section and being like, yo, these are awesome. <laughs> that is so funny. Oh shit, did I make room for these things? Damn it. Okay. Oh yeah, I did. Okay. The toy section, <laughs> yeah. The toy section, I love going there. <laughs> Which Joe, let's take a smoke. That is so funny. I'm a child. Nah, but they they got some great stuff there, like I'm uh I'm always like in a ama like amazed by like what they have. And I'm like, damn it, I, I like I always wanna buy something there, but I'm just like, dude, I what would I do with it? Okay, when I'm in the Georgia, you can come visit me. I'll take you to the toy section. <laughs> you can leave me there while like you do all the shopping. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. That is so funny. Yo, let me know if you can hear my fan. It's I feel like it's kind of loud, but it's helping me so much right now. I thought I heard that Texas is going to get extremely hot tomorrow, so... Uh, there's a music box, but... Okay, yep. Take the music box, please. Hell yeah. I am your fan. <laughs> You're loud, uh, JK. Thank you for being my fan, Cheems. Thank you for coming out. Yo, everybody, thank you for showing up. It's been awesome. 
<laughs> the chat has been so lively lately, dude. I love it. It's all thanks to you guys. It was ridiculously hot today, though. Oof. Tomorrow might be worse, dude, so watch it. Montana is a beautiful 43. Dude, that sounds cold. 43 is cold, like freezing cold. I would not survive. I would need my San Marcos. Where am I? Oh, look at that. <sighs> okay. The game has, like, just decided to give me all the health in the world. Okay. Wait, what is that? I need that, actually. I'm sitting here in shorts and a cami by the open window. It's great weather. Oh, that sounds great. Sounds really nice. When was it? I think it was like last week. Last week I had no air conditioning whatsoever. And uh it was it was horrible. I was sitting I was <laughs> I was sitting uh, next to a window sweating in the restroom because that's the only place that we had like an easy open window. Hold on, let me see what's this. A man's portrait here is displayed. There's a large scratch on the canvas. Oh, that's the dad. I remember. A man's portrait displayed here. All right. Well, I guess that w that's it. That's all I needed to get. Security card. Let's climb down the ladder. Now, why? Hmm. Okay, so I need to turn on. I need to turn on the. Um... Damn it. I'm forgetting. I'm forgetting shit now. I need to turn on the, um, the self-destruction, yeah. Before I do that, I am going to save. This place has got to be the self destruct room. Let me just go ahead and go over here. Okay, so I'm gonna need that. Oh, what? I have... Okay, hold on. Okay, okay, hold on a second. We're gonna need this, we're gonna need that, we're gonna need that. I don't think we're gonna need this. And we're gonna need that. Maybe this? Nope. <laughs> Maybe this. And you know what? I'll take one more health item. 
just in case. And I'll leave one slot open, just in case. Coming towards the end, I want to thank everybody again for coming out. I think I thank y'all a lot. Let me know if it gets annoying. Wait, I didn't bring it. Fuck. I'm so dumb. So why haven't you tried the Borderlands game? Uh. <laughs> Yeah, we were, uh, we were talking about that, right? Um, I have never tried a Borderlands game. I've just never played it. Um, I guess I always wanted to play it with like a group of four people because that's how I hear is like the funnest. But everybody's already played it. And then back when like Borderlands was, uh, I think Borderlands One was coming out. Um, everybody had already played it. I got it, and I was like, yo, I'm, like. Let's go through it, and nobody wanted to go through it with me. Um, and yeah, that's that's basically the story for every Borderlands that comes out. Like, I'm just like, hey, come on. Now, um, I for one, stop myself from playing it. Like, it's not like they don't want me to play the newest one. It's, I just have that game row CD where I'm like, I want to play the first one before I play the other ones, but nobody wants to do that with me, and that's totally fine. Like, uh, that's totally. That's totally fine, cause like, who'd, who'd want to replay a game that they've already played, in probably like countless hours. It's just me that like I have that gamer OCD where I'm just like, dude, I need to play the first ones and stuff like that. And yeah, I get made fun of because of it, <laughs> but it's just how I am. Like, I'm more into a story, and I'd rather get the story from the beginning or like the narrative from the beginning. Then like jump in from jump in into the middle. Um, I think Tiny Tina's I'd be willing to play without playing one, two, three. But um, I don't know. At the same time, I'm also just like I don't know. Should I play it? Is it good? I don't see anyone here saying it's bad to play the first one. To play the first one out of the series. Oh, trust me. <laughs> yeah, I get it. I get it a lot. <laughs> oh, oh, you mean Tiny Tina's? Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, I hear. I hear people saying it's good. I hear people saying it's good. Maybe when I get paid, I'll I'll pick it up. Maybe our friends, my friends, will work, and I could play that. Uh, could play it together. Hey, Nerona, maybe we should play that together. <laughs> okay, let's see. Isn't this, there's something suspicious about it. Oh, there's nothing suspicious about it. <sighs> it's, uh, it's the streaming. <laughs> it appears to be some kind of control panel. Emergency. Use this card to release the security lock. Card. Okay. Where can I do this? Where can I do this? Does anybody know where to initiate the security lock? I thought it would be here. Some kind of control panel. No spoiler. <laughs> oh man. I've actually already beaten this game before, like way back when. 
I just don't remember it. Oh man, I don't remember. I don't remember where to use that. I'm guessing it would be... Hold on, okay, let's see. Let's just put in the fire, f the little dragonfly thing. Maybe I think that's where it should be. I should just follow my heart. Uh, <laughs> I do appreciate that, Nerona, but no spoilers. I really do appreciate that. You want a complete, true game. I get it. And a, a complete experience. This song has been going on for far too long, though. It just keeps looping and looping. It's not the most annoying song, but... I'm already ready to finish it. Spoiler! <laughs> oh no! Here comes Cheems. Nah, Cheems knows better. Okay, yes. You unlocked the door. Okay. Let's see. Oh, show. I guess, yeah, this is where, I soap, where I'm supposed to be. You gotta fly back to the island. <laughs> Dude, imagine there's like a part four. And I have to go back. Alright, here we go. I think this is it. This is it. This is it. This has to be it. Ooh, another herb. Sims in the city. There's a terminal that can release self-destruct system. Use the security card. You put the security card in this card slot. Self-destruct. Please enter. I remember that we got a um, folder. Saying this was the code. Oh, 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 oh. I can't spell. Has to be it. All those locks have been released. Okay, awesome. This facility will detonate in five minutes. Dude, that zombie has like no clue what's happening. Where's the MB man? It's just gonna explode. Alright, here we go, y'all. We're at the end. We're at the end. You made it! Of course. Come on. Let's get out of here. Oh, oh my gosh. Should have okay. kissed her when he had Turn the, the clockwise simultaneously on three. That's Got his it. sister, <laughs> Nerona. <laughs> I know you're not. This is like the first thing you joined. One, two, three. Oh no, it's a thing in some places. I'll keep her busy. Just go for the emergency elevator. Chris, but I can take care of this. Just go. You have to make it. Don't die on me. Will do, Crystal. <laughs> Hey, you butt. Oh no! 
Oh, damn, I fucked up. <laughs> <laughs> That was so anticlimactic. Oh my god. Nah, don't, don't tell me I'm gonna start from here. Oh my god. <laughs> oh. That is so funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> Yo. We got years ago in the chat. We got the bad ending, y'all. <laughs> That is so funny. I'm sorry. <laughs> Dude. That is so funny. Oh my god. Okay. Alright, 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 alright. Let's go, let's go, let's go. This facility will detonate in five. <laughs> All doors are now. <laughs> I'm still laughing at that, oh my god. Okay, alright. <clears throat> I guess, I mean, the shotgun's gonna have to do. Thinking about it, I feel like I should have brought more ammo. Again? Damn it. I ran. <laughs> oh, this is. Okay. 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 This is dumb. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, stream. I'm sorry, chat. This is so dumb. <laughs> this is. <laughs> Here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, not again. Okay. Should I just shoot her from like where I'm standing? This facility Deja vu. For real. I'm gonna shoot just from where I'm standing, okay? Okay, yeah, that's all I gotta do. We're good. I think we have a lot of health. Wasn't this supposed to get a, a rocket or something? Oh, 
Oh, what? Yeah, the music's pretty tight, though. I have to admit that. Oh, come on. Oh, God. What's happening, dude? Thank you. I actually thought I was gonna die there. If I die, I'm probably gonna get more uh, ammo. I was about to press... Okay, come on, come on, come on. What? I can't even see anything. What the heck? Okay. Why does this remind me of a Final Fantasy boss fight? Final Fantasy 14 boss fight. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Let me break it. Use a tank, tank LB, level three LB tank. <laughs> Chris, uh, move. Uh, clear. Uh, clear. Whoa. Dude, why would he do that? Please tell me I'm done and I don't have to fight another boss because I have no health. Please tell me I'm done and I don't have to fight another boss because I have no health. Chris! This doesn't look good. This looks like an arena. Well done, Chris. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now, the only thing left is revenge. Let her go, Wesker. You don't want her. 
fine. Claire! Today's a good day. I came for Alexia, but killing you is even better. Oh, really? Sorry to disappoint you, but Alexia is gone. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. What? Steve. In his body, there's still a living T. Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. Maybe he'll come back alive, just as I did, and be able to see your sister again. You freak! Don't you touch him! I'm sorry, dear heart. But my men have already taken him. No. You get out of here, Claire. But what about... As a surviving member of STARS, I have to finish it. Remember your promise. I'll end this once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who you've killed. I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. Oh man, I'm scared. <laughs> Am I gonna have to fight him? Hell yeah, metal pipe. Shit, it's over, dude. Chris failed. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. What's going on? There's a lot of loading. <laughs> Damn, dude. Can we get the bad anymore. ending? <laughs> but just look at the power I've gained. <laughs> Magnificent. Don't you think? Hell yeah, Whisker. It's kinda hot. I could totally see this moment being real hype if this was like the newest Resident Evil game to come out. We finally get like to see Chris versus Spencer after the mansion. This would have been real hype. Fucking jeans. All right, dude. <laughs> Today's your lucky day. Next time we meet, don't count on another. Next time. Until we meet again. <laughs>
thank God I didn't have to fight him. I was I, I was worried we were gonna have another salt sesh. keep my promises <laughs> <laughs> this is so silly dude Chris promise me please promise that you won't leave me alone again I'm sorry Claire but it's not over yet there's still something we've got to do you mean yeah it's payback time we've got to destroy umbrella now Let's finish this once and for all! Oh my god, that was so corny. Yo, we... <laughs> we finished this damn game. Hold on, y'all. Let me, let me lower down the volume. I don't want to get claimed or anything. All right, <laughs> so we finally finished fucking Code Veronica. I am so happy that we finished it. <laughs> now I guess this is the part part of the stream where where I I talk about the game that I just played. Did Code Veronica? It started off pretty strong, honestly. It started off really strong I was having a lot of fun with it it was very silly sometime around the Chris when we switch over to Chris that's when the game just decides to be extremely unfair you you share your you share your items with Chris and unless you know this You've you've given you've given I was gonna call her Jill. You've given Claire all your items, all the all the like all her weapons are with her. That when it's time to play as Chris, he's got nothing. He's got nothing in his chest because Claire has it all on her. So it was so frustrating getting through Chris's the Chris's moments. Yo, Mochi! Thank you so much for showing up. He finished. Thank you, thank you. Thank you for the applause. So, and, and there's a lot of... and It felt very cheap because, like, you would you would pick up one item and you'd have to backtrack. And there's, like, four, four zombies, new zombies, waiting for you. It was, it was just very... It was just a lot of bullshit, but it was a lot of fun playing it with y'all. I think if I was to, like, okay, I think if I was to play this a second time alone, I probably would have just quit. I probably would have just been like, you know what, I don't need to play this anymore. But, you know, to complete it on stream, you guys definitely helped me and, you know, making it enjoyable. So thank you very much for that. Where is Chris? Chris took off with Claire in a jet. We're not done. We got to take on Umbrella. All right? That was that was where we left off with Chris. How many stars? I usually do I usually do out of 10. <sighs> I would give this I would give and I and I grade by like, you know, kind of like this, kind of like the American school system, American school system, brother, where a 70 is passing. I would give this game like a, like a six. I'd give this game a six. And a lot of it, it has to do with 
with switching between characters <laughs> the text it is showing <laughs> a lot of it has to do with switching between characters and you and you have nothing with you and you have absolutely nothing and then like the backtracking the backtracking was oh my god but I say a six I mean it's not it's not the best game but it's not the worst game you know it's definitely a game that you could play you need to play once if you're if you want to experience Resident Evil you don't really have to of course but if you want to play them all it's definitely fun for a first run yeah, it is a PS2 game. It's def it definitely shows its age. It definitely shows its age. It's actually a a Dreamcast game. Like it was like made before. So it definitely shows its age. Um but yeah, man. It it's it's frustrating. It's it's a frustrating game sometimes. But I definitely do want to play that fan game that they're making of Code Veronica. That one looks really cool. It takes the model of Claire from Resident Evil 2 Remake and they recreate a lot of it. If you haven't seen it, go check it out on YouTube. It looks really cool. Maybe I could show it. <coughs> nah, I don't want to show it. I don't want to show it. But yo, we're done. We beat Code Veronica. Thank you again. Everybody came out and said what's up. It was awesome. It was a lot of fun with you guys. The next Resident Evil game that we're going to tackle in the series is Resident Evil Zero. Now that is... Oh, that's a nice picture. I like that. I'm a fan of that. Anyways, we're going to be tackling Code Veronica. Um, I'm sorry, what the fuck? We're going to be tackling uh, Resident Evil Zero. I have not, I, I've actually never played that one. Uh, well, I played like maybe like an hour of it and was like, you know, I can't. It's I, I was Resident Evil out at the time. Uh, but we are going to do Zero. I'm excited. It's got this like switching characters mechanic. Uh, but like probably done a lot better hopefully it's a lot of fun and if you haven't played it well now's your chance to experience it with me but the next game that we're going to be playing i think might be uh the new kirby game when i get paid on thursday <laughs> um if i get it on thursday uh i'm probably going to have to come up with something tomorrow so the next series will be kirby um if not maybe something else but I'm shooting for Kirby and uh, we will we will come back with that series we will play that series um, for now just you know follow me on Twitter check me out on YouTube give me a follow here that's that's all that's all I could say <laughs> all right guys that's gonna be it thank you so much for everybody who came out I want to thank uh, we had uh, in order we had Amy who came out we had Crystal who came out uh, Pretty AV, Nerona then we also had uh, Cheems as well as years ago guys thank you again and I am out I hope you guys have a great rest of your Tuesday yeah Tuesday <laughs> alright see you guys bye bye <laughs>